Will Michael Myers be confirmed supernatural in Halloween Ends? This is a crazy theory. Let's face it guys, since I started making Halloween theory videos, there have been some crazy ones. I think this might be the wildest I've seen, but this is what we do on the channel. If you don't like it, you're going to have to leave because you. this is going to piss some people off. Now, I saw this on the Halloween Reddit and uh, just screenshotted the kind of paragraph that was wrote. I did try and go back onto the Reddit and find it, but I can't. So, I apologies to if you wrote this, if you saw it. I doubt you're going to be watching this, but just in case, I did want to credit who wrote it, but I I literally can't find it. However, we're going to have a little read of it now. I'm going to read it to you. So this is about Halloween ends. Now, what you actually need to worry about is ghosts. Remember, this is a timeline where supernatural elements are made clearly visible to everyone. The mask slash Michael making the inmates and dogs become agitated. The ghostly images, Laurie and Karen see of Michael when he isn't there. And Michael's darkness seemingly having some connection to Judith's window and possibly the young Michael ghost. Couple that with the Figaro references from the ghosts of Vesalis, Vesa fucking, I don't know, I'm thick. Loomis calling him a boogeyman, Laurie calling him the shape, and Tommy calling him a phantom. Allison says Michael has haunted this town for 40 years. Laurie saying that Michael transcends with every kill. The Christine Connection, a film in which ghosts ambiguously exist and can manipulate the world. So this is the guy's theory slash Fear. My fear is that in the third act of Ends, they'll find out Michael physically died in 2018, maybe having crawled into a cave and bled out, and the Michael they are now fighting is actually a fucking ghost. I'm going to say right off the bat, personally, I hate it. Again, it's his fear. This guy doesn't want this to happen in fairness, so... But I did see it get some reactions in the Reddit, so I thought we'd make a little video about it. Now, here are my thoughts. Now, one thing I think we can all hopefully agree on to some extent is that Michael is somewhat supernatural in this trilogy. You know, whether something's powering him or he just has this inhumane ability to take damage and shit like that. But the idea of Michael being an outright ghost is just wrong to me. Let's say they did go with this. This would shock the shit out of us, or at least me anyway. Now, not necessarily in terms of this theory, but the idea of Michael being supernatural in any way. I think my guess for Halloween ends is that we aren't going to have this explained to us at all. And I hope that is what happens. I hope it is just left to like, he's somehow doing this. We aren't given any explanation that he's like a ghost. He's powered by this, that. You now, if you're a subscriber of the channel watching this and you've watched my video on like what the shape is to me, you'll know that I, along with what seems like a lot of people, think it kind of defeats the purpose of Michael if you explain him and give him like well an explanation and one thing I am thinking of is unless obviously which I expect it will uh, Halloween ends is much tamer and calmer you know we really are crossing that fine line to a point where we're almost making it kind of hard for Michael to not be some kind of like supernatural force just with the damage he's taken and just coming back like nothing happened but yeah in terms of Halloween ends I don't think we're going to be seeing Michael levitate or or visibly do anything that is described as like paranormal or magic or whatever you want to call it. I think it's just as we've seen in previous ones, it's going to teeter on where you're thinking like, what is he? He's a he's a big mystery to me. That's what I like about Michael. We don't need him explaining. I think what this guy's wrote is smart in terms of like the way he's linked it and it makes it seem a certain way, but I'm very interested to see the comments to this theory. What do you guys think to this? And if you have any ideas of your own that I haven't covered or anything, feel free to put it in the comments below and who knows if I have enough to say about it I'll probably make a video on it because that's what I seem to do but yeah that's my thoughts on the theory as I said let me know what you guys think and I will see you guys in the next video